This is an overview of the blood and the immune system. In order to properly defend the body, the immune system must reach every part of the body. To do that, the immune system hitches a ride in our blood. It's important to understand that our blood and immune system share cells as well as organs to create overlapping functions. This team approach also includes other systems, like our cardiovascular system, skeletal system, respiratory and lymphatic systems. All are tightly integrated and work together to create, nourish, and enable proper cell function. At the beginning of the process, blood cells are born in our skeletal system, in the bone marrow, then migrate to our blood vessels where they are transported by our cardiovascular system, passing through the respiratory system to collect oxygen, which they deliver to cells throughout the body. Then on the return trip, the oxygen-depleted cells release their carbon dioxide back out through the lungs and begin the process and the cycle all over again. The lymphatic system also works to help filter out waste from the cells of the body, but it also holds in reserve key fighter white cells. But before we look at how these systems work together to do all this, let's first look at the story of our blood, which begins with the hemiotopietic stem cell in our bone marrow, which we'll see in our next video.